Hey, welcome back to Rolling with BJ in the Kitchen. Tonight, I'm doing lima beans and okra. If you want my recipe, keep watching. Okay, I have my lima beans soaking in cold water and I picked out all the bad ones. And then when you put the water in there, if you see any float to the top, you take those out because those are no good. But all of mine are sitting still, so that means these are all good. So I'm gonna drain the water off of these. We're gonna put them in the pot. We, I got a ch half a chopped onion. We're gonna put that in the pot. And our seasoning, one tablespoon of seasoning salt, one tablespoon of garlic powder, and a half a teaspoon of pepper. And I'm just gonna mix this up. And I'm only gonna put half of this in at the beginning. Later, after I taste it, if I want more seasoning, then I'll add more. But for right now, I'm only gonna put half of this in the pot with the beans. The okra is already done. All I did was boil some hot water, put like a half a teaspoon of salt in it, let the water come to a boil, and then I put the okra in. It was one bag, one big bag of whole okra. I put it in the pot and I let it cook for about 20 minutes. And then I cut the fire off and kept the lid on so that they won't get mushy and slimy. I'll show you the okra later, but for now, we're gonna take one tablespoon of minced garlic and we're gonna put that in the pot as well So here we go. One tablespoon, I think I'm gonna do a tablespoon and a half. But we're gonna take this over to the pot after I drain the water off the bean, off the lima beans. Okay, we're over at the stove. I got my pot and I had some turkey tails cooking. And I cooked them for a very long time because I like for them to just cook off the bone into the meat. So as the meat, as the lima beans cook, the meat is going to continue to cook off the bones. So I drain the water off the lima beans. And you don't want to let them sit in water too long because the outside shell will start coming off. Okay. So we're going to mix those up in there. We're going to add the one tablespoon. Of garlic, minced garlic. We're going to add a half an onion. And we're going to put half of this seasoning in here. Okay, I'm gonna save the rest for later after I taste them. And the minced garlic and the onion is just gonna give these beans a lot of flavor. Okay, now I'm gonna add two cups of water to the water that was already in there. So it really, the water that was in there was just the juice from cooking the turkey tails. So now, I've added two cups of water. So now you see the color. So these are gonna be really good. So you just wanna cover them with your lid and let them cook for about maybe, I'm gonna let them cook on medium for about an hour, medium high for about 45 minutes to an hour and I'll be back. Okay, my water have cooked down, so I'm gonna add two more cups of water in mine. And I'm gonna give it a stir. Actually, I might put another cup. I'm gonna put another cup of water in here. Because I want my juice to cook. Not my juice to cook. I want my beans to cook, but I want my juice to be really thick. So in order for that to happen, I have to have a lot of water in here. 
So I'll be back. Let me get two cups, of, two more cups of water. Okay. There we go. All righty. So now that I got some more water in here, I'm gonna cut it down to medium low, or maybe I'll just leave it on medium. And I'm gonna let them cook another 30 minutes, maybe 30 to 40 minutes before we check on them again. So put the lid back on. See how all the meat is just cooking off the bones? That's how I want it. Okay, so I'll be back in about 40 minutes. Okay, it's been about an hour and a half total time. Let's see what we have here. Okay, this is about how I want mine to look. See the texture and the thickness. They look really, really good. Now we got to taste them to see if we need any more seasoning. Let me get a fork. Well, I actually got a spoon. So I want to taste the juice and make sure the beans are cooked. Boy, they look good. If yours tastes like this, cut the fire off and you are done. My gosh, they are good. Mm -mm -mm. We're going to come back and give these jokers a name. Oh my goodness. They are good, you guys. They are really, really good. Just enough seasoning and everything. So I'll be back and we're going to name, claim, and have a bite. Okay, here's our lima beans and okra. So I was told that it's supposed to go together. So I didn't know that. So we're going to just eat it like this. So I'm going to put it in here. And then I'm going to... Okay. Oh, this is good. Okay. So we're gonna name this. I like this. We're gonna name this back in the day lima beans and okra. Once again, thanks for rolling with BJ in the kitchen, and I will see you on my next video. Thanks for joining me and do have a blessed day. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with a friend. And I'll see you on the next one. Back in the days when I was younger, I'm not a kid anymore. But some days I sit and wish I was a kid again. Back in the days when I was younger, I'm not a kid anymore. But some days I sit and wish I was a kid again. Back in the days when I was younger, I'm not a kid anymore. But some days I sit and wish I was a kid again. Back in the days when I was younger, see you later.